Hey book brushers, we are here to show you today how we made the Amazon A plus stackable images much easier to create. So let me just hop in and show you. You can do this now in the custom creator. So where it says choose a tool to begin, click custom creator. And under the Amazon logo over here, you'll click the Amazon logo. And you'll see the first option is now the stacked A plus standard image. So this is going to be a way for you to create in one image, something that's going to download as three images. So we'll click this. Here's a quick example of what Amazon is showing as their example. So this is the Amazon website and it's these three stacked images. So we had a way before where you could create them one by one. This, this thing is a game changer. So we'll click in here, go to the background step. You can search millions of free images or you can upload your own. We'll try for something under love and scroll through. So before I click it, I want to make note in the workspace, you can see these little green lines. These are going to be where it separates. So it's going to download as three separate images where those green lines are. So we can click, put an image in the workspace. Um, I usually like to use the eye icon in the lower right corner here to see what's inside and outside the area so you can make it larger and then position it how it's going to work in the workspace. So keep in mind with this one that it's going to cut off with those green lines. So if I scoot this up and just the very tips of their heads are in the other image, you may not be as happy with that. So kind of position it to your liking. Then you can add text to each one. So we'll go over to text, add a new text box, and I can paste in my first blurb on edit text styling and explore in the font area such as add more fonts you have access to a thousand fonts in here and I like to filter like display and handwritten so we'll find a font here click mark click and check mark it and then you can see it under just added fonts and I'm going to reduce the size to let's say 35 we'll try that and you can position it in the workspace if you want to make the text box um, wider, skinnier, however you want to do that. And then if you want to do another text box with the exact same font so it matches the color and the size and so forth, click the plus button in the lower left corner. So you've got another one. Now we'll just edit the text in this one for our next bit of the blurb. Then, whoops, my... I really can't type life through a curveball. And I'm going to take this one and make it just a little bit wider. So it's kind of centering in that dark spot. Again, plus button to add another one. And we'll finish with an additional little blurb here. Is there love strong enough to survive all right that will be the question and i'm going to line this one up in this section but i think i'm going to make it a little bit longer here so it's in two lines and have it sit in here so this is how easy we just made quick three images added text boxes i'll click back to the amazon example fairly similar so they've got three images like that so we'll go up to download you can download as a PNG, JPEG, or PDF. Right here, you won't see the lines, but the magic is going to happen in the background. And it's a zip file. So these are going to download like the instant mockups do, where you need to click Extract All. And you can see the different images that are here and they're available for you. Let's do them like skinnier so you can see them a little bit better. There's your three images that you can upload right into the Amazon so that they will look like this. All right. So we hope we made your life a breeze. All right. Take care, everyone.